Good morning, you motherfucking sunshines. Motherfucker, sun is now rising over the canyon. Hell yeah, 7.30 up and rolling. Let me get some compy last night. <clears throat> that bridge down there, there's the beach I was at. Um, like two people rolled in last night, not a big deal. It's to be expected, you're at a fucking water source and minimal, minimal tent spots this last stretch. So most people stayed at that fucking hot springs last night. They've all been goddamn rolling through this morning. I'm sitting my ass right here. I do not like hiking around people. I wanna be by my fucking self. So I'll sit here, wait, watch this fucking sunrise. And give myself a little buffer before I start walking, but still up and rolling early. 32 miles to Mickey D's. I don't know, we'll kind of probably make it there two days. Maybe two and a half, we'll see. I kind of want to roll in there in the morning so I have all day to charge my shit to put me, push me on the right wood. So we might do a couple short days and then roll in there the, the, the next morning. We'll play it by air, figure it out. I'm in no rush today. We're gonna enjoy this goddamn sunshine. Hopefully get out of this fucking canyon today. Although gorgeous, I'm ready to be up top. So that is it. Let's get on down the fucking trail, man. It's gonna be a great fucking day. First time I turned the corner and it wasn't mountain ranges after mountain ranges. Except for Bait and Powell, we still got that bitch to climb, but I want to get all philosophical on your ass for a minute. Because it's such a beautiful goddamn morning. And I want to talk about positivity and being fucking happy, okay? As cheesy as that fucking sounds. We are all human goddamn beings. I'm guilty of it every single day, multiple times a day, bitching about this and that. I'm fucking hungry. My feet hurt. It's hot. I'm fucking, I'm almost out of Nutella. You know, okay, I do it every fucking day. We all do it. But in the big fucking picture of things, I am constantly reminded out here that I should be fucking dead, okay? <laughs> Five years ago, I should have been dead. Alcohol should have fucking took my goddamn life. And ever since I've gotten sober, I've learned in the big picture of things to be fucking happy. What, how, how shitty is fucking life that you have to dwell on bullshit, okay? When I fucking got sober and I looked myself in the goddamn mirror, I said, dude, do you want to fucking live or do you want to die? Be fucking happy. Life is fucking amazing. Look around you, okay? And the more you dwell on the shitty situation that you're currently in, it's just going to escalate the fucking issue, okay? Be fucking happy. Every morning I wake up on video for you guys as I'm walking and I say, today is going to be a great fucking day. That is not some cheesy catchphrase, okay? I say it because I fucking mean it. When I tell myself it's gonna be a great fucking day, it's gonna be a fucking great day because I've got air in my lungs, I've got a backpack on my back, I've got the beautiful Southern California desert, and I got miles of fucking trail ahead of me. I'm only got like a half a jar of Nutella, but that's okay, we'll make it through, man. Today is gonna be a great fucking day, man. Be fucking happy for what you've got, not what you don't have.
tuna again. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> Alright, shit still tastes good, man. When you're fucking burning calories in this goddamn sun, anything fucking tastes good. And I hear a little water source is trickling and just enough to get some water. But I found me a little shade bush. There's two lizards fucking over here two minutes ago. I tried to get them on film, but they ran away. They wanted their privacy, apparently. But I'm going to choke something down. We're like 10, just over 10 in for the day. I still have to make a decision if I want to just cut the day short and uh, do another short day tomorrow and roll in and make EDs the following morning. Or just push my fucking ass today and get as close as possible rolling the Mickey D's tomorrow sometime around lunch. I still haven't decided that yet. My feet are fucking screaming that sun's blazing today. So I guess I'll uh, have to take a look at the map today at lunch here and decide what the fuck I want to do. I climb off from that road, it's no fucking joke. That's hot, man. That heat just sucks the fucking life out of you. Yeah, like one more wild water, hopefully. Uh, all right. Catch my breath, we'll keep pushing, man. Silverwood Lake. How's that for a fucking water source? <laughs> All right, fuckers, here's this little stream here down by the highway. Man, my body feels fucking awesome today. I was limping for like a mile. My right foot was having some pain, but it went away quickly. Oh, I just feel like a goddamn hiker today. It's awesome. Um, <laughs> I'm strongly considering doing the 13 miles, which put me there about 10 p.m. the night to Cajun Pass, and I will fucking sleep right at the goddamn McDonald's, run the front porch on the first goddamn smiling face they see in the morning. I don't know, dude. Uh, in camp, like the, my original plan was like in five more miles. Um, I just been hauling ass today, but I feel so goddamn good. I almost want to fucking just push all the way to Cajun Pass. <sighs> all right, fuck it. I'm going for it. We're heading to Mickey D's, man. 13.1 miles. That'd be 32 for the fucking day. This will be the longest day I've ever done on a fucking trail. I just my body feels too goddamn good, and I want to see what the fuck it's capable of. <laughs> Eleven and a half miles to Mickey D's. I can taste that motherfucking McDouble's mine. Actually, all I can taste is the sweat dripping off my fucking mustache right now. Ten miles to McDonald's. I want some extra sweet and sour sauce, bitch. miles to McDonald's. Fuck you mean you don't have the McRib. The McRib is always back, motherfucker. Eight miles to McDonald's. Six more miles to McDonald's. 
Bet you thought I didn't know about the Mick gangbang, huh? Oh, I know. I know all about that shit, man. <laughs> Five miles to go. That's one hell of a fucking view. Man. Four miles to Mickey D's. That milkshake machine better not be fucking broken, man. Let's take a look at that shit. That is fucking unbelievable. <laughs> Three miles to go, fuckers. My feet are starting to feel it. I think we're all downhill from here, though. Hell yes. Look at this fucking shit. Oh. I'm on top of the fucking world. Eat your fucking heart out, Leonardo DiCaprio. Ugh. Two miles to Mickey D's. I'm gonna beat that fucking sun there, goddammit. Hold on, goddammit. Turn on the fucking afterburners. <laughs> 1.21 gigawatts, motherfucker. One mile of McDonald's. I can taste that shit. When you wake up in the morning and you tell yourself it's going to be a great fucking day, it's going to be a great fucking day. I'm going to go get my ass some fucking McDonald's. Today was a great fucking day. We'll holler at you motherfuckers in the morning.